Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of The Long Drive. We have driven 86 kilometers. I think we went four kilometers in a freaking hour from yesterday. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode. So it seems to be as if uh, we have a direction, at least, where to go from here. It seems like... Uh, is there sound? Okay, there's sound. It's just very quiet. Uh, it seems as... Can I turn that on? Oh, look at that. That's awesome. Seems as if we have a direction on which way to go. Looks like the major—I say majority loosely, <laughs> but it looks like um, the truck is the way to actually go going forward. But you know, I'm actually kind of. I say happy, but now I'm like freaking out. Uh, which actually, I'm actually quite happy. I don't even know how I'm gonna get that shit out of there. Uh, I'm quite happy about. Uh, because one it's just uncharted territory we haven't driven a, a truck more than you know what we did a little bit yesterday um, but we can at least do a quite a bit of things I've been told with the truck the only unfortunate thing uh, has been said dude we're almost out of gas <laughs> oh good thing I checked before we left uh, luckily we have all of the diesel that we can get for the most part here I think we have another drum at the uh, restaurant also, which we are going to go back to the restaurant for sure. Th this is like one of the most complicated mechanics in the game. Anyways, um, yeah, so looks like you can do a lot with the truck. So we are going to roll with the truck and see where it can get us. I've been told that you can haul multiple trailers, which is incredible. Um, there's a fuel trailer. There's a flatbed. Dude, a flatbed trailer. Okay, so hear me out. If you can watch out, if you can actually... Oh, there if you can actually have a flatbed trailer and you can load like a car on it, oh, ho, ho, ho. watch out. The world is ours. Ours? Ours? You understand. Let's go ahead and fill up our truck because I did not realize we were running on fumes. Um, and I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna test this out. So, what I'm gonna test out here is I'm gonna open that up. There we go. I'm going to fill it. I'm going to check how much fuel we have now, and then I'm going to drive all the way back to the restaurant, and then I'm going to check our fuel again, because that will give us an idea of how much fuel this really burns, because uh, I have no idea how much fuel this burns. Um, it seems like with the other cars, like, fuel wasn't burning that fast, but why would I have one liter of diesel in it? I can't remember if I filled this up at the gas station or not. I could have not have, uh, but let's make sure we close that, and uh, let's let's hit the road, yeah. Uh, a lot of things that are missing, speedometer, uh, temperature gauge, whatever, 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 uh, even a club box, I guess we might be missing, doors we're missing, so a lot of, you know, vital stuff we're kind of missing here, uh, and our engine has oil, or, sorry, our engine has water in it, which is also bad. Let's go. Another thing that uh, I was told was, um, we do not have the correct what is it? Coolant radiator um, for our vehicle. So apparently the radiator that we have is actually for, oh my God, let's slow it down. Slow it actually down. Slow it down. Slow it down. This is working actually. I feel like I'm at a water park, like a water slide. <laughs> um, Oh my god, we lost. Oh, we're, we're losing stuff. Time out. Time out. What did we lose? Is it is it important? Probably not. It's probably not important. A little bit of oil. Probably gasoline. Now that we've, you know, we don't need to worry about gasoline because, you know, we're, we're on the... We're on the truck train here. Yeah, this is, this is brutal. Um, anyways, as I was saying, the radiator that we have is... Is for a bus. And it's not for a truck, but it's gonna work. Um, so I do need to keep out a uh, lookout for a truck radiator. I don't even know what that even looks like. Um, hopefully it stands out to me, you know, and the way I mean stand out to me is like, hey, this is, um, this is, you know, this is, this is different from a regular car radiator and this is different from a bus radiator. I am like literally trying not to like flip my lid here. Now, there, is that a building over there? I think that is a building. I'm just going to coast it backwards here. What is that? Is that our is that our destination over there? Have we lost the road? No, because that's the boat. Yeah, we're going the right direction. Where's the road? I don't know, but there's a building over there. I think I might go over there. 
Why am I drive, driving in reverse? It's the easiest thing to do right now without like causing chaos. It's a little bit of a shame that we did lose our uh, oil drums. Um, but it's all right. It is what it is. I'm not too worried about it. You shouldn't be worried about it. Yeah, that is a building. It's a building we've never been to. Which one? Oh, the, the freaking truck doesn't have a radio either. That's that's a big bummer. Well, let's see what we got going on here. Why, hello. Welcome. <laughs> Could you imagine, like, this is, there's actually somebody here? I'm surprised we didn't, like, run across this on the way here. Turn this off. Now, let's actually check how much fuel we have after that cabacle. I didn't even check to see how much fuel we had when we left the boat. But I'm assuming we had about 30, uh, 30 liters there, so I think we're fine. Pallets. I wonder, uh, pallets and if they're good for us. Gas, don't need. Can we open this? Can we move this? What is this? Just a piece of wood? What is that? Nothing? Okay, so far, not good. <laughs> so far, nothing. Just, like, crouch. There we go. Okay, let's continue on over here. We have a bed. We got, like, a little shed? Yeah, it looks like a little shed. Okay, this was the most disappointing thing we've ever encountered. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and just, like, you know, sleep the night away. There we go. Is it like oh we have the hubcap i was like why is the truck glowing it's because we left the um the light on in there all right all right so it is still a little bit dark but that's okay i think oh yeah there's the road okay i see the road i was gonna say i think the road is in this direction it certainly is let's go and turn this bad boy on turn our lights on start it up oh do we not have headlights we might not even have headlights all right we are literally missing everything for this truck this is kind of crazy Someone said, you know, you have the truck, but you're practically missing every piece from it besides the motor and the radiator. I see it now. Uh, you can definitely see it. We are missing a, quite a bit of stuff. We're missing doors. We're missing... Heads up. <laughs> We're missing uh, the radios, speedometers, uh, headlights, which we can all take from the car back at the restaurant if... We did not pass the restaurant. I don't think we did. I think it's over there in that area. Yeah. Yeah, because I remember that rock. So it is off to the left here. Yeah. So not too bad. All right. Cool. I think we're going to be actually making a lot of progress today. I mean, the fact that we don't have to worry about this engine, like, constantly overheating. And we have, like, a... Oh, dude. Oh, I thought that was a, a jerry can, but that was the cactus. And the... What the hell is on the top there? Why is there, like, a hatchet on the top there? You see that? We're missing that, too, whatever it is. And again, we're missing, you know, the back end of this. The back side of water. <laughs> Alright, so there's the boat. It's been real boat. Um, really good find. I, I, I really like that. I'm glad they have that in the game. Somewhere that you can kind of guarantee that you will, uh, you know, get some... Get, you know, it's just like a stash of cash, really. A stash of... I mean, yeah, gas, oil is technically cash, right? <laughs> so a stash of cash, I really enjoyed that. Fantastic. All right, so let's continue. Oil, uh, this, again, like I said, we could probably, like, adjust this in the future. Probably dump this out. If we can get, like, a snake coil or whatever the hell it is, uh, empty out that, get strictly just oil in there, and that should, you know, that should be fine. I mean, even, like, right now, it's it's fine. But to what extent? I'm just going to leave the light on. All right, so here we are. We're going to take some parts now. Um, since we've already made the decision, we will not be... Uh, that radio is still going? Okay, I think... So, okay, time out. <laughs> Stuff has reset. As you can see, there is now two vehicles on the, on the restaurant. So this is good. This is good. We might be able to find some good stuff here. Just be careful. We'll let, you know, Rage Radio do his thing. Okay, gasoline. Scrubby. You know what? Yeah, I, I, I want to do this right now. I, I really do. Uh, this is a good time. So, I want to pull this in. And I want to actually take care of this truck a little bit. Um, in the sense of, like, whoops. In the sense of, like, scrubbing it down. 
making it look nice. I think this is a good time to do that. Let's go ahead and pull this thing back up in here. Look, there's a bike there too. We could probably maybe even bring the bike with us, throw it in the back or something. Let's do that. Fantastic. Jump out. Hello. There's a door. Don't know if it's a truck door, but it's a door. What the hell is that? Oh, it's a coolant. All right. Let's turn the lights on in here. We got a gun. We got scrubs. We got, I almost said books, but it's not a book. It's actually uh, a wheel. <laughs> I don't know how I missed that. Red. Actually, that, is that red? Dude. Let's try this out. Nope. I mean, yes, but I want to clean it off more. Let's do that. This is right. Yeah, that's right. Let's grab it. Okay. Just, like, throw it on the ground. Pick this bad boy up. Oh. All right. Now let's make it red. Oh, look at that. The orange is actually kind of cool, too. But I just want to make it straight red if I can, if it's possible. Okay, maybe this is not red. Maybe this is just orange. That's all right. All right, looks like that is just orange. That's okay, you know? A truck orange. I, You know, I've always wanted to drive Oscar Oscar Wire, Oscar My, Oscar Meyer Wiener <laughs> trucks. Now, this looks like a big thing. Now, is this? This looks like a bumper. Can we attach this? I don't think this needs a bumper. No, it doesn't need a bumper. Um, I was told that the hitch is somewhere in the back here. It's very hard to see, but it is something that we can do. So that's good. At least, you know, I don't need to really worry about that quite as much. What is that? I think that's our hatch. <gasps> is that our hatch? That I was complaining about? Let's see. No. No. It looks like... Oh, my God. It looks like a barbecue grill. Is this a hatch? What is that? I would say that's a hatch. Hmm. All right. Here's another coolant. Right? No, that's a keyboard. There we go. We got some jizz in it. I heard a rabbit. He's coming. You see him? You see him? He's on my car. He's he's now the size of my car. He's attacking Rage Radio. He lost. Rage Radio got him. Great. Uh, what does this do? Does this do anything good? Like, wait, attach? What did I do? Like, I need to know what some of this stuff does. We'll put that over there because we we'll probably need it. That's a gun. It looks like, it's like we haven't found any ammo, though. There's a lot of scrubs here. Do that. Do a little bit of this. Anything else? Uh, brown, possibly silver, white. Not really interested. All right, let's continue. Open up. Heard something. Oh, look at this. All right, what do we got here? We got an oil drum full of water. Wow, that's a lot of water. <laughs> I don't think I need that much water. More scrub stuff. Uh, bunch of blow-up dolls, I think, right? Um, let's go into here. Pointless bottles, really probably don't need to worry about that. More jizz in it. Um, I want to check the dumpster in the back. Have we peed it? Then like we probably haven't peed in like five days. That's incredible. Bladder of steel. Let's see. Uh, still looking for a coil. Looks like a bike mirror. Still, we've we've seen a couple of those. Big tire, but it's not really in in a good shape. So I think that's good for there. The only other thing that we can do right now is go on top of the um, go on top of the 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 restaurant somehow. What is that? Oh, it's a bar stool. Can we get on top of this? <laughs> we might have to use a box. Let's use this. And we got a couple boxes behind the, the work shed too as well. Oh my god. Okay. Hey Great job. Alright. Now that we are up here, we can take a look at what we're working with. I mean, this is kind of pointless, right? We don't need this. This is... Oh, dude, this is a big motor, actually. That would have been uh, perfect for the other car, too, I think, maybe. Or just for this car. I don't think we've seen this car. Well, we have, maybe, um, in other episodes, but not in this playthrough, maybe. There is this, right? There is this. I don't think that will go in the truck, but I'm going to put that down there anyways. Does this have a radio? It does have a radio. It's a nice-looking radio, too. Can I 
actually dismount that? Yeah. Okay, throw you out there. We're gonna take that for the truck as well. Anything else in here I can take? Um, no, I think we're okay. Let's put the radio out there. What about, oh, what about this car? Does this car have anything good? Ooh, I think this might have the right speedometers we need for the truck, actually. Let's go ahead and dismount that. Thank you very much. Oh, that, that went way farther than I thought. Okay, get out. Get out. Oh, my God. All right, so up here is all good and, and dandy. Don't think we need anything else. I think we are just fine. Yeah, okay, we're good. So let's go in. Oh, God. Let's go down here. Oh, God. Um, Let's do the, yeah, this. This is what I want to do first. So, nope. Pick it up. Pick it up. Equip it. All right, let's 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 see if this works. Hopefully this works. Oh my God. Yo, it works. Nice. Certain stuff like that, dude, I tell you, it gets my, it gets my gears rolling. Let's pick up this little brushy brush. See if we can scrub anything. I don't know if you can scrub the, the cabin here. Doesn't seem like it. Um, how are the wheels? Scrub it, scrub it. I mean, it kind of looks a little bad, but maybe not. Maybe it just needs a nice, like, brush go through it. Oh, dude. Can we do this, right? Hopefully. <laughs> I would like this to look better than what it does. Again, I might need to use a different brush for that. Yeah, that looks way better. That looks better, better too. All right. Let's go ahead and just put that down for a sec. Let's grab this. Maybe this is what the wheels need. Hopefully this is it. No? Are these wheels just wheels, man? <laughs> Alright. Um, I don't think the trailer needs any scrub and dub dub, right? No, no Sesame Street there. Um, okay, let's... I guess the... the this? No, not this either. Alright. Can we actually, like... Use the spray bottle on it, you think? Let's see. Man, my nose is itching. Uh, let's see here. Let's do... I don't want to waste this. Okay, that's wasting it. Um, oh, can we do this? I feel like these are two different... I feel like they're t different tires, maybe. Maybe one is like a bus tire. tire. One is like a, uh, uh, a truck tire. I don't know. They could be the same, though. Okay, so at least something got clean for the most part. We don't have doors, uh, so we can take them from our friend over there, our friendly vehicle, which we will do. I don't even know if I have anything in the trunk of this vehicle. Oh, I do. What do I have? Okay, I have that. What is this? Is this oil? Okay, that's a full thing of oil, which we're going to take, and an empty jar can. Let's go ahead and take the full full thing of oil yeah we'll take this i'll be real with you it doesn't feel safe in the back of the trunk and i don't even know how to get into the trunk i mean yeah that you probably just have to jump and crouch in there but that's i hear it i hear it okay we're good i think we're fine um oh do we have we oh wait so the jerry cans are way back there if you see it you can see it way, way back there. Yeah, so getting in here might be a problem from time to time that I'm going to have to figure out, but that's all right. All right, so let's go ahead and come back here. We'll bring an empty canister too, just in case. You never know. Um, I mean, we could take water. Yeah, we could get water here. We do have the capability of doing that. So let's, let's do that. A little nervous. Okay, let's go through here. Can I just jump over this? No. Good God. All right, let's get this. Uh, let's actually put this on the table right here. Yeah. There we go. Open that up. Fantastic. Do this. Fill that up. And then at least we have water. Because, again, I want to actually dump out... Well, we haven't checked our coolant, have we? We might need some water in the coolant. There's a few things that need to be redone. Like, the engine needs to have a full thing of... Oil does not need to have water in it. 
Uh, but it works. It works. Does it work efficiently? No, probably not. Hopefully this is working. This seems like a lot of water right now. I think it's fine. Like 20 liters, right? 20 liters. Okay, what the hell are we filling here? Okay, it's full. I don't know what we were doing then. <laughs> Alright, let's take this out. We'll put this in the back too as well. Admittedly, this doesn't look good because it looks like it can fall out anytime. So I'm going to try to tuck it as much as I can right there. Um, and then, yeah, let's go get some doors. I wonder if you could put a, like a, just a random door on, oh my god, on the back of the, um, on the back of that hatch just to cover it up some, just to make sure it doesn't like fly or anything fly off or anything. Does it seem like that's the case? That's all right. And then let's just see if this goes right here. Can we do this at least? Doesn't look like it's possible. All right, so no doors there. Okay, so I think we're ready to kind of take off. Now that we have a speedometer. Oh, wait, hang on. Before I take off. Water's good. Water's good. All right, let's go. All right, bye-bye restaurant. It's been real. You've been a lifesaver, I will say. Have a great freaking day. Look at us in our Oscar Mayer wiener truck. Oscar Mayer wiener truck. Dude, that truck used to come to my town quite often. And it was, like, fantastic. If you don't know what that is, you should probably Google it and get a nice chuckle or something. Um, but, yeah, so I am taking a look at the jerry cans. Jerry cans are staying in there. There is one peeking out a little bit. One thing that's going to... Oh, dude, I love how orange it is. Um, I freaking left the radio. It is what it is. I left the radio. That's bad. Uh, so no chat till you die, which, let's be honest, that's okay. <laughs> I'm fine with that. I'm fine with no more chat till you die. Um, so we should pick up, like, some ground here for sure. I love the orange. I, I was trying to make it all red, but the orange is not too bad. Okay, let's actually uh, turn off the truck here. This is unnecessary. It really is. Like, we're, we're not, like, struggling or anything, but it's just more of a, you know... A feel good power kind of moment <laughs> like yeah my truck is rolling it's not turned on but but i could have probably put headlights on too on this bastard but i am going like a hundred mile or kilometers an hour um my truck is off so i'm just coasting it baby okay i feel like i am gonna tip this thing over here so let's go into the third person it's gonna suck now that i don't have uh headlights it's gonna really suck all right hold on tight this is our moment to shine Hey -oh! Do not go off the side of the hill, and that's exactly what we did. You should probably turn your truck on, young man. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, let's get some momentum. There we go. So far, so good. Yeah. This is like, again, this is like one of the most uh, successful times. I'm just gonna double check. Yeah, we don't have any lights. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna say, this is like one of our most success. Why is there a shadow? Wow, that kind of spooked me out a little bit. Maybe because of the mountain there. Um, this is like one of our most successful times ever having a vehicle that runs properly. Well, I guess you could argue that's not true because like the first car, I guess, ran decently. Yeah, the first car ran decently. But I guess this is our n first new car that runs decently. <laughs> Like, we tried new car back there with, like, a, you know, a truck engine and, and, and all that. And it ran well, but, again, it, it would just keep breaking down, overheated, bad issues from time to time. You know, stuff you just don't want to, you don't want to really see, right? One issue I can see is uphills. Uphills will be... Um, very challenging and I can't imagine going uphill with a trailer now what is like the most powerful engine to have in the truck is it the truck engine is there any other more powerful truck engines is there different other truck engines or is this the most powerful engine in the game because if it is the fact that we're having tr trouble going up this hill is a little bit of alarming it is it has now became that time of day where it's just 
freaking dark. <laughs> Holy crap. It's like very hard to see. We do glow a little bit, don't we? Now, who are the people coming out here and like doing maintenance to the street lights? Like after all these years, maybe a post-apocalypse, you, you wouldn't think like these street lights would all still be on. You would have to assume maybe one of them burnt out at one time, but no, it looks like they, uh, they're pretty much good. <laughs> they're all good. Oh my god, this is all downhill now. We went uphill, now it's going downhill. Oh my god. Holy crap, we are cooking. I cannot see anything. It is, it is, it is, this is bad. This is actually really bad. This is really bad. This is bad. Why is the downhill such... Oh my god. Hold on tight. Something's spilling out. I don't even know what's spilling, but something's spilling. What is... What? Huh? What? What are you? What are you doing? <laughs> wow, that was amazing. What was spilling out? It might have been our engine. We're still going. <laughs> By the way, we're still going down the road. Uh, that was crazy. Um. I wonder what was spilling out. It looked like it was coming up from here. So maybe from here. But these caps are on. At least they think they're on. They should be on. That was, that was crazy. Never seen a hill that big in this game before. All downhill. Especially doing it at nighttime. It's like you're, you're driving off the cliff with your eyes closed. <laughs> like I, I could not see what was happening at the bottom of the hill. But today is definitely a day of progress, for sure. I could be missing stuff off to the side, but, you know, it is very dark. I've only seen one UFO. I cannot even see rocks in the road. That is potentially dangerous. Um, I've only seen one UFO, and luckily he we were stopped off on the side of the road, so we didn't have to deal with him. Yeah, I cannot see rocks. Something green over there. Green light in the sky. Okay, another uphill battle here. What? I'm like really worried. Like, what was actually pouring out? <laughs> Alright, so here we are. We're back at the top of the mountain. Looks like we will be going downhill again. Oh, baby. Oh, my God. Oh, yep. Just turn it off. Just turn it off. And let's just enjoy this ride down the hill together. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This looks a little bit smoother, I will say. But again, I can't see if there's any rocks in the road. If there's like a giant rock, we're gonna just launch right off of it, because I can't see anything. I am zoomed in. Oh my god, there's the rock. Yep! <laughs> oh my god! I couldn't dodge it. Oh my god! Hold on tight! Hold it! Hold it! I am so sick. I'm gonna throw up. Oh, I... Get me out of first person. Oh lord. That hurt the soul. <laughs> oh my god. Start her up. We lost our speedometer. How dare you take our speedometer. On another note, we are a little bit stuck in the pole there. So, yeah, if you ever thought that we were going to hang on to our jerry cans, yeah, good joke. We did not hang on to our jerry cans. Um, how, again, just like turn off the engine again we lost our speedometer that sucks something is still pouring out of the vehicle here and i do not know what it is hopefully it's not the fuel tank if it's the fuel tank we are so freaking screwed probably something i should have focused on a little bit more before i left the restaurant watch out for the rock oh my god i saw watch out for the pull yep 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 we hit it a little bit yep that's a cactus don't mind me start this bad boy up let's get back onto the road this is great. <laughs> Anybody complaining about, you know, we're not making up a lot of distance. 
we should probably get it going or it's gonna cost a thousand episodes look no we're making distance today you gotta love it out of spite just run the rabbit over there you go <laughs> was that unnecessary absolutely that i feel good doing it absolutely all right i'm surprised we haven't found any buildings like honestly like we've been on this road for a while now and no building has jumped up at us and i feel like nighttime has been uh, a very long process uh oh okay this time we actually lost uh oh we lost engine power this isn't good are we out of gas or is our coolant or rate or did our engine overheat i really hope our engine or one i really hope we didn't if, if, if our engine's overheating i'm fine with that but if we ran out of gas this is going to be the worst day of our lives this is a long hill as well give me a building of some sort we need something holy crap light is coming light is coming do not kill your momentum just stay you know what just stay hit it hit it from the back hit it from the back don't hit the rock he hit the rock don't hit the boulder he almost hit the boulder i think our fuel oh my god i think it's our fuel that's gone okay all right okay steer it steer it steer it steer it steer it steer it go down okay we're gonna there is a tower right there so that's fun will it start okay go okay so it looks like we still do have fuel great might be a cooling issue that we have going on right now that's okay I, I can deal with that we've dealt with that in the past quite a bit so i'm okay if the if the if it overheats i'm not okay if we run out of gas what is that okay it's just okay that was disappointing i got a little excited that's like, oh it's an antenna yeah to what to nothing to absolutely nothing dude this is awesome <laughs> like this long uh oh we lost power this is not good especially going up a hill now oh no no hope in sight either come on get it going oh this is gonna be a pain oh this is gonna suck yep we just lost power again all right well i guess this is the time to kind of like reassess ourselves yeah definitely not out of fuel definitely lost everything in the back as far as water goes um i'm gonna check the coolant here oh dude we don't have one <gasps> that's why we actually lost that that's an issue that's a huge issue i wonder how far we didn't even notice that we lost it oh that's a big issue that is gonna hurt us well i do have to say i'm impressed that the game did do that but at the same time that is terrible terrible news um screenshot <laughs> uh yeah so the fact that we wait a sec there's something there well there's a rabbit but there's something right there it doesn't i don't know why my guy's shaking so bad it doesn't oh dude there's a gas station there's a rock and a gas station oh my god we might have been saved we just got to get there well I, I say saved not confidently because i doubt there's going to be a radiator there but we'll truck this as much as we can and try to get to the gas station or whatever that rock thing was all right i'll, I'll cut to it. i'll see you then all right, so we should be at the top of the hill. And by the way, it took me forever to get to the top of the hill. Should be at the top of the hill. So anything going down forward is good news. Still overheating, of course. That's why I'm kind of coasting it right now. Um, but I think I see the gas station off in the distance. You might not be, be able to see it, but I think I can see it towards this bottom of this little hill down over here. So this is, this is potential. Um, I don't know, like... I, my hopes are not too high because it's a tiny tiny 
excuse me, a tiny, tiny gas station. Like, I can't imagine there being a radiator there, but there is going to be something at least. Let's turn off the engine again. We'll kind of coast down. Does that make it better? No. Okay, it's coming up. We're like right on it. Almost. <laughs> All right. Let's start up the truck here and we'll pull in. Actually, I'm not going to pull in. I'm going to stay on the road. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, stop right there. All right, here we are. We're here. Okay, stop there. What I'm going to do is I'm not... Oh, I can't sleep yet. I was going to say I'm actually going to sleep away, but... Look like that's not the option. So forgive me as I go into this dark, dark gas station here. Oh, wait, I can turn on a light. Oh, look at that. All right, so we have a bumper. Not going to help us. We have a pail. Not <gasps> alcohol and water. Not going to help us. We have a visor. Not going to help us. We have a light bulb. That could be just good for our lives. <laughs> gas, regular gas. Don't have that as well. Let's see if this actually fit. Fits into our thing here. Can we mount this? No? Really? Alright. Um. No radiator at first glance. It makes sense. I mean, I wasn't expecting something too big here. Um. Bad stuff. Yeah. Uh. Huh. I mean, is this a big bumper? Can we actually add this? I'm not even sure what the hell this is. Let's go ahead and see if we can do anything with this. I think a bumper would, uh... Yeah, it is a bumper. Nice. I think a bumper would kind of protect us a little bit going forward. Now, again, this is the only building I, I've, you know, I, I saw in, in, you know, off of the distance. So it could be... It could be a while before we see something else. Um... So what I'm going to do is uh, the sun is coming up. I think I'm going to end up as episode here. Thank you guys so much for stopping by and hanging out with me today as we play the long drive. If you want to see more of the long drive, you know what to do. You got to smash that like button. Um, if you are new to the channel or if you are lurking in the channel, if you made it this far into our long drive series, consider hitting that subscribe button. Maybe. I don't know. Um, yeah. So let me know what I should do. I mean, I, there's not a lot of options I can do. I mean, we have to go forward. We have to go. We're not going backward. We have to go forward and hope for the best, really. Um, we have an overheating truck. And anytime we go into collisions here in, in later in the series, I will make sure to reassess our vehicle before proceeding because I didn't even notice that we lost our freaking fan. All right. Until next one. Do take care. This is for all of you, not just a song to listen to, something to give you hope to hang on to. Uh -huh.